Is it set up? Is it on? Hey guys! <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Essence of Shea here. Hola. It's hot. I just came from outside. And <laughs> believe it or not, it's cold again. But whatever anyways guys welcome back to my channel don't forget to like a comment and subscribe to my channel make sure you're sharing all my videos make sure you're turning on those notification bell because a lot of you guys weren't aware that I did live I did a live video and all that stuff click that little bell and then you'll know anytime I post anything so I wanted to talk to you guys about things that they don't tell you <laughs> when you're starting your locks and I feel like like you guys are family so I should be the one to break it down to you this is not gonna be a long-winded video because I know you guys don't like those but I'm, I'm gonna try to get to the point number one locks are not the easiest style to maintain they are not they are not. You need to wash them, you need to trim them, you need to retwist them, you need to do all that stuff. Unless you're doing free form and your locks just grow any old way, then akuna matata. Be weekend all up and through your locks. The weekend, you know, <laughs> the weekend. Number two. Locks do attract a lot, a lot of lint. It doesn't matter what you do, what kind of protection you think you're doing, it's just the nature of the beast. They attract a lot of lint. So be mindful of that with the, 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 the type of things you wear, the type of things you put on your head. Just know that even if you are a person who wears silk through and through, you can get lit in your hair by just the items that you put in it. Um, it could just be your car seat. It can just be what, whatever it is, it will attract lint. Number three is everyone's hair is different. Mine's might grow in a fast, rapido pace, and yours might take a year and a half for it to grow. Does not mean that it's not doing what it needs to do. That's why me and a few other people in the lot community are always saying, do not compare your journey to others. Everybody's hair texture is different. Everyone's hair is different. And that goes into number four. What might work for your hair may not work for mine. And I was under the misconception that everyone can with locks could use the same products. Unfortunately, we can't. Some people have scalp issues and they can't use oils, which means that all they can really use is like aloe vera and light stuff and rose water. They can't use like the heavy oils. Some people like me can. Some people have to moisturize their hair every single day. Some folks like me, every three days, once a week. These are things that people don't say. They make it seem like all locks are the same and they are not, Tiger Lilies. They are not. Another thing they don't tell you about locks is that they get into everything. They get into everything. They get into everything. Your food, you sit on them. They they get snagged under somebody's arm when they try to put their arm around your shoulder. Into the popcorn at the uh, movie theaters. Into your drink. Like, Lord, Father, God. They get into everything. Folks don't tell you this. When you eat, try to take the hair and push it back. 
folks don't tell you that they just let you sit there with your hair just hanging all in stuff and then wonder why you're so irritated that your food now has pasta sauce i mean your hair now has pasta sauce folks don't tell you these things it's like they're haters they keep these stuff to themselves and i am I'm not understanding why. The thing folks don't tell you when starting your locks is that you don't moisturize your hair with oils. You moisturize your hair with a water soluble, meaning H2O, meaning rose H2O, meaning aloe vera juice water-ish thingy. These are a few things that I feel like you guys need to know in your lock hair journey if you're just starting, if you're in it for a while, or if you've had it for a long time and nobody told you stuff. There's a few other things out there. <laughs> we could get the discussion going and I'll leave it in the comment box below. But I thought this would be fun just to discuss the things that folks do not tell you when you're starting your locks or when you have your locks. Folks keep this to themselves. Anyways, Tiger Lilies, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to click that notification bell. Follow me on all social media platforms at essenceofshade.com. Don't forget to visit my website, www.essenceofshade.com. Calm. get my lavender um, hair spritz get my covet oil get my yes for edges get my shea butter get my sugar scrub all this stuff is natural ingredients and good for you and your melanin and your hair growth get it now 15% off on all orders over 30 30 dollars right now right now right now into the cold tiger lily at checkout and you're good to go tiger lily squad let's go anyways guys i will see you on thursday i might do a live video i don't know if you have any video requests leave it in the comment box below and i will see you guys next time see you later tiger lilies toodles crash course let me hide the money in the dashboard Max Mad, could you lost the brick inside?